Well, I was delighted to host a civic reception here today to honour the uh, phenomenal achievements of one of our own uh, citizens here at Ballinasloe, uh, one of our own residents, uh, Aidan Sheridan, uh, and his team of Sheridan Swims the Shannon. Uh, because Aidan has done a remarkable feat, uh, several feats in fact. One was to swim the Shannon, 245 kilometres over 15 days, um, it's a remarkable achievement. More people have walked on the moon than have swam the Shannon, and uh, Aidan is now the sixth person to have swam, swam the, the length of the Shannon. But in doing so, his uh, remarkable feat was also to raise over 50,000 euro for a, a local charity here, which is East Galway Midlands Cancer Care Services. And this is an extremely important charity locally. The reason why people are so generous, I think, is because cancer is a condition that affects every family. We all know somebody who's had cancer. There's a high likelihood that somebody we know will get cancer. And we all w are aware of the services that are enabled to be provided free at the point uh, of service by people who are generous enough to give to these charities. Uh, we're very, very fortunate that we have people that are very active in our community uh, who think of others. Uh, Balance Law community has never been found wanting. Uh, even this week we've had the Balance Law Christmas jumper appeal and uh, I think in one day alone 5,000 uh, was raised for the Balance Law Social Services and this again is just extraordinary generosity. Uh, because the people of Ballinasloe are very empathetic and they reach out and they care for their neighbours uh, and they realise that without these services that people will be left in a lot of need and want uh, and they're big hearted. Uh, it, it's, it's an absolute pleasure to have been able to host this in recognition of one of those remarkable people that we have and there are many many more but certainly the phenomenal achievements of uh, that individual, Aidan Sheridan, have got to be remarked. And it has been a pleasure uh, that myself and my colleagues here uh, hosted a, a civil reception uh, to mark that. Uh, the reason I've marked this, I suppose, is with regard to the massive physical and mental endurance uh, which Aidan had to overcome to swim 245 kilometres, as I say, in, in 15 days. I suppose Aidan has, uh, in the past, run 52 uh, marathons as well. Um, uh, and it was a whole uh, of community response. It wasn't just one person, and I think Aidan would probably be the first to say that it wasn't just him, it was the team around him, his family, the support services, the civil defence, everybody who got in and out of the water with them, uh, the people who generously reached into their pockets and donated uh, to the cause, the people who uh, propagated the uh, publicity about the cause and raised awareness. Uh, and I think that's another thing that Aidan has done, is through this remarkable achievement, he has raised awareness uh, about cancer, not only cancer itself, but also of the services that are out there, the um, importance of early detection, uh, the fact that people need supports and their families need supports throughout the, their cancer journeys. Uh, we have a lot of people, thankfully now in Ireland, living with cancer as well. Um, but we know that the uh, incidence of cancer is increasing uh, as we get older and as our population ages. And it's a very, very common condition. Uh, and as I say, it's one that touches every family. Uh, and for that reason, it was marked. But it, this is not to take away from everybody's fundraising efforts throughout our communities, uh, which has, you know, shaped the type of communities we have. Caring, uh, empathetic, uh, responsive community. Uh, and when, when a cause is highlighted, people are very generous uh, and they do reach out and they try and help. Uh, I feel honoured receiving the award today of uh, the Planning Law County Council and Evelyn. It's, it's a, re a real honour to, to get it because I believe not too many people received them. Not, not at all. I didn't expect any of this. I only expected to raise a few quid and uh, it's up to the East Midlands and Cancer Support of Brackerna and 
that was it. I'm not into all this uh, awards and stuff. This this is a, a different. Uh, makes me nervous, and uh, I'm out out of my comfort zone here doing things like this. Well, I know that the uh, cancer support up in Brackerna are uh, buying a minibus out of their their share to transport people with cancer from here to the hospitals and back. So hopefully the the bus will be there for many years to come. Uh, Ballinasloe is a great town and if they see someone putting in an effort to usually get back them and get behind them and they saw, they saw that uh, it, it wasn't something that was done too often so the town really really rallied around and uh, as you can see we, the town itself we raised over 40,000 I think in Ballinasloe alone so I'd like to thank all the, the, the team, all my family, my wife and my two kids and everyone that supported Sheridan Swims to Shannon. Uh, it was. Uh, an amazing uh, couple of weeks and uh, something I'll never forget.